Exhausted from their encounter with the troll, Harry, Ron and Hermione returned to the Gryffindor common room and discussed the strange goings on at Hogwarts. Harry suspected that someone had released the troll to distract everyone so that they could get into the Forbidden Corridor. But there wasn't much time to think about who was behind this, especially since Harry was busy preparing for the second Quidditch match against Ravenclaw. Up! Welcome to Quidditch! I'm your commentator, Lee Jordan! It's Gryffindor versus Ravenclaw! Play Quidditch! A glint of gold? Is that the snitch? Here comes the Ravenclaw Seeker! Potter seen the snitch! No! The snitch got away! A near miss for Potter! No! Keep it, guys! And saved! Amazing skill! Oh, you lost the snitch! Ouch! That must have hurt! Come on, Gryffindor! Oh, uh, sorry, Professor. Sorry. Look at those seekers go! This is amazing! Oh! Oh, hard luck, Gryffindor! Uh, what? Ah, look at Potter go! Ouch! He turns, he misses! Stay on target. Here comes the Ravenclaw Seeker! Harry Potter closes in on the snitch. I've never seen such flying! The crowd is on its feet! Come on, Harry Potter! Potter's moving in! Potter's gaining! Roger! Come on, Harry! Um, sorry. Ah! He's getting closer! Look at Potter go! He's had it! He's going in! Hard luck, Potter! Those lodges were just too much! Exhausted from their encounter with the troll, Harry, Ron and Hermione returned to the Gryffindor common room. Harry suspected that someone had released the troll to distract everyone so that they could get into the Forbidden Corridor. But there wasn't much time to think about who was behind this, especially since Harry was busy preparing for the second Quidditch match against Ravenclaw. Up! Welcome to Quidditch! I'm your commentator, I'm Lee Jordan! It's Gryffindor versus Ravenclaw! Let's play Quidditch! A glint of gold? Is that the snitch? Roger! Here comes Potter! Stay with it, Harry! Potter's moving in! Wonderful! He caught the snitch! Gryffindor wins it all! My name's Lee Jordan, signing off. Thanks to Harry's skill as a seeker, Gryffindor won the Quidditch match against Ravenclaw. Harry, Ron and Hermione spent most of their free time in Hagrid's hut, trying to convince him that he couldn't keep Norbert, his beloved dragon. Eventually, after much coaxing, Hagrid agreed. Harry unwrapped the unexpected Christmas present. Something fluid and silvery slithered out. It's an invisibility cloak, said Ron. They're very rare. There was a note with the cloak. Your father left this in my possession, Harry read. Use it well. A very Merry Christmas to you. Harry tried on the cloak, while Ron and Hermione helped him prepare for the climb up the tower. Be careful, Harry, said Hermione. You can't stay invisible while you cast spells. Filch might see you. With Norbert safely bundled up, Harry set off for the tallest tower. He hoped that the cloak would conceal him from Filch and his cat, Mrs. Norris. <laughs> 
Corridor. Uh. 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 Where is he? Pray I don't find uh. you, my stealthy little student. I get up there. Who was that? Someone's got past me. Regret it. 
gets past Argus Filch and makes a fool of him. think I'm blind? I'm not letting anyone into that tower tonight. come in handy if I have to distract Filch along the way. <laughs> I'll catch you, and when I do, you'll regret it. Ron's brother, Charlie, had arranged to collect the dragon from the tower and return him to Romania. <laughs> 